on this phone and obviously as you can see the phone in front of me is locked and to begin the process we will need to back out to the first page from here let's change the language to any kind of other language that uses different uh, letters so Greek, Russian basically anything below here will suffice uh, there we go so from here let's progress to the setup once more uh, skipping basically everything And keep in mind, you can see right here that I have a pattern uh, as a way of verifying uh, verifying the phone. But I can also do it through Google. And now the pattern will be quite an important part uh, as you will see later on because we're just going to completely change it. So there's the Google. From here, tap on the search bar, or not search bar, but the uh, field where you need to input your email and hold the globe icon right over here this will bring up the language select so let's stop on that right here the text and from here we want to add a keyboard so blue button right over here and choose any option with uh, without an arrow so as you can see there is some with with an arrow select any kind of option without the arrow and from there tap on add which is again the blue button once you do so go back again to the first page Oops, too far. There we go. And now let's change the language back to our desired language, which for me is English. And from here, again, let's go through the setup. And again, there's the pattern for verification. Let's just use Google again. Uh, tap on the field again and from here let's hold the globe icon once more this time around we're gonna start off by changing into the uh, Query alphabet, which is the middle option for me Then hold it again and go to language settings Add keyboard and now find an option with an arrow. So there is Albanian Let's select that And from here tap on the three dots go to help and feedback and in the describe your issue you want to type uh, Morse code O or just MO seems to bring it up as a suggested as you can see so use Morse code tap on it as you can see there is a video so you want to click on it give it a second it will load it up and from here you want to tap on the three dots on the video and select watch later from here welcome to Chrome so accept and continue and no thanks we don't want to sync and from here tap on the search bar on the top and you want to navigate to hard reset that info slash bypass like so let's go and from the app uh, or from this page you want to scroll down and tap on the settings this will in turn open up our settings on the phone and from the settings you want to scroll down to security scroll down tap on the screen pinning enable it lock device when unpinning and from here select a method of uh, protection so as I said before, uh, pattern was a kind of an important part of this process. So just to change it up, I'm not going to go with the pattern. Uh, this time I'm going to go with the pin. So it's completely different to what it was before. So one, two, three, four. That's what I'm going to set. Again, let's confirm it. One, two, three, four. Confirm. And now basically what happened is our pattern got overrated, overridden with the pen that I have set just now. Now we don't want to add any kind of fingerprints, so I'm just gonna skip this. And from here you wanna hold the power key, restart, and wait for the device to put back up. Thank you. 
So from here, let's unlock the device. Uh, as you can see, it now requires the pin that we have set. So one, two, three, four. Let's confirm it and go through the setup. So once more, let's just skip most of this right here. And again, verify. So right here, this is previously where was uh, where we could see the pattern and now it's telling us to verify a pin and uh, well we know the pin we have set it so one two three four enter and device basically becomes unlocked as you can see now we can simply sign into our google or skip it now it is still advised that once you finish up the uh, setup right here you go to settings and perform a factory reset through settings just to remove any kind of re leftovers from the previous account uh, but you can in this case i believe you can just skip it but like i said it is advised And there we go. As you can see, we're now on the home screen. And I'm gonna show you how to uh, get it fully re well, reset and basically get rid of everything that uh, the previous account. And so to do so, let's open up settings. Simply scroll down to system right at the bottom, tap on advanced and you should see reset options. And one of the options is erase all data, factory reset. And, and here you can see that one of the things that will remove is your Google account. And that means that it also removes that Google account that was previously blocking us. Um, now I'm not gonna go through it just to save on time, but if you want to be super safe, you can go through it like so. And this will basically completely clean the device of every kind of leftover data. So that is how you would bypass uh, CAT S62 pro and if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching